Hello guys and girls, welcome back to the Racing Line for another circuit guide here on iRacing. This is week 10 of season 1 2021 and the IMSA Sports Car Championship with me driving the BMW M8 GTE. This week's circuit is Road America, the full course and the time is set to the 1st of April 2021 at 8.30 in the morning to match the official race time sent out on the season 1 PDF. This is quite a difficult track to learn but a fun one, a nice long lap time. As usual, same format as before, a breakdown lap followed by a full speed uninterrupted lap followed by an off-board lap. And don't forget, this is filmed before the week has begun, so it's difficult to compare lap times. But let's see if we can help you guys find some time. So as we come up the main straight now, a nice long straight. We want to be on the left-hand side, getting ready for the pretty much 90-degree right-hander of turn one. We're looking out for the cones on the left. You see four cones here. You can push the braking zone a little bit further if you want to. And we're going to go from sixth down into third gear. And then we're going to get back on that throttle as early as we can as we ride the inside curve and use all the track on the exit and climb back up through those gears. Hold it on the left-hand side and look far left. You'll see a number two board. That's our next braking zone from fifth down into third once again. A little bit trickier than the first turn though as we want to coast in, trail break in and be patient on that throttle to get the best exit we can down another long straight and a prime overtaking opportunity as it's right into a heavy braking zone. You want to keep an eye out for this heavy braking zone. As we come down this straight, we're going to stick to the right-hand side. It's quite a sharp left-hander and we're going to look out for this number three right here. We're going to break from sixth down into first. Hard braking, try not to lock up. Remember, it's downhill. Go into first initially. I'm going to go back straight up into second to get the traction out of this corner. All important, using that little bit of runoff there. Next braking zone, the radical sign on the right-hand side. The first one, we're going to go from third down into second gear. This time braking uphill ever so slightly so you don't lock up. Coast in again, get on that power and be careful of the grass on the exit up into third up into fourth quick lift off back on the power no brakes there and then down to the right hand side getting ready for this next left hander braking zone the number three board from fifth down into second gear again hard brakes in a straight line and be patient on that throttle coast into the corner get on the throttle careful of the grass on the exit and then get back out to the middle of the track kind of i'm going to slow this down look for the dirt patch on the right hand side just there that's where we're going to come completely off the throttle and coast mid corner and then look for the armco on the right as soon as we pass that we should be back on the throttle full throttle now carrying it through that long right hander a difficult corner but a fun one to get right this next bit we're going to be in sixth gear quick lift off not fully, just a half lift and then get the power back on. And then you should carry your speed all the way down into another overtaking zone. Looking for the number four marker on the left this time. There it is. Hard brakes, sixth down into second gear. It's a 90 degree right once again. So hold it on the left hand side as long as you can. Down to second. Use the curb on the inside. Use the runoff on the exit. Careful of the grass there on the left. And now we're going to go up into fourth. Quick lift off. Back on the power pretty much immediately using all the track. Final braking zone is where the tarmac changes, just there. From fifth down into third gear. So brake, come out to the left, get it turned in, coast in, and then get the nice widest line, widest entry you can as you ease onto the power and go up this nice long straight for your final overtaking opportunity and across the line. It's a lot to take in this lap, so let's go through that again, but this time full speed uninterrupted. So we're looking for the four cones on the left, sixth gear, down to third. Here we go. Hard on the brakes. Down to third. Get it chucked in and then get on the power as soon as you can. Pretty much before the apex. And then we climb back up through the gears. Left hand side looking for the number two board. From fifth down to third. Again coast in. Patience on the throttle. Get it on now. Smooth on the power using all the track on the exit. Careful of the grass. You can have a quick breather now as you gather your head. Gather your thoughts. You can defend if you want to. Overtake if you can. Looking for your braking zone for this next corner. All important corner this one. Looking for the number three board, sixth, down to first, hard brakes, right out to the right-hand side, straight back up into second, get the traction out the corner, use the little runoff, and then get back to the right-hand side. Looking for the radical sign, dab the brakes, down to second, coast in, patience on the throttle, get the power down. Careful of the rear end there, it gets very unstable. Up into fourth, quick lift off, back on the power, and then downhill we go for the next braking zone. Looking for the number three board, fifth, down to second, coast in. Patience on the throttle, get it down, use the track on the exit, careful of the grass, come out to the middle. Up into fourth, look for the dirt on the right hand side, there it is, lift, completely, coast, look for the armco on the right. Now, start feeding it back on. And then away we go, flat out through this section. So fifth, up into sixth, watch the throttle input here, half input, quick lift off, back on the power, carry the speed through. 150 miles an hour going through there. Left hand side now, looking for the number four 
There it is. Hard on the brakes. Sixth down to second gear again. Coast in initially. Get on the power at the apex. Use the track on the exit. Careful of that little grass. Up into third, up into fourth. Over to the right-hand side. Lift off. Back on the power straight away. Use the track on the right-hand side. Back over to the left. Tarmac changes. Fifth down to third. Right out to the left. Open up the corner. Back on that power and away we go down the straight using all the track on the exit. And now you should get a nice run down into turn one. That is... As I said, difficult track to learn, but it is fun once you start getting it right. So keep at that track. Keep practicing it. As usual, that is pretty much it from me. So I'm going to leave you with this off-board lap. Don't forget to keep those likes and comments coming in and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Let me know how your races have been going. And as usual, if I don't see you on track this week, then I'll see you next week for the next video here on The Racing Line. Peace.